somebody stopped me when I was about to come up and they were saying that they were a single father. Is he back in here yet? Okay. All right. Wait for a second. But this one ain't for you. Play something? Something. What the hell? So ladies, check this out. I hate to contextualize a whole performance that seemed to be so love focused. I just, I don't know, you feel energy in rooms and you just kind of go with the poems you feel. So a lot of them have been that way, but it's not like that typical of me to get up and do that many love or, you know, uh, female oriented, like, you know, worship poems. But since I'm doing worship poems, I just wrote one. So this is how we're gonna do it. The name of the poem is Worshipped. So ladies say I should be worshipped. I mean like you mean it, like, you know what I mean? Cause you have to claim it, right? So say I should be worshipped. All right, so slower and lower. Whenever you think I'ma say you should be worshipped, I want you to say on top of me, I should be worshipped. Like this. You should be like, even, you should be worshipped. But don't even try to say it after me. Try to just rush in when I say it. Like you know it more than I know it. You should be worshipped. You should be worshipped. Instead, you're surrounded by a perfect circus of clowns. Even lower. Good tempo, but lower. I'm sorry. But instead, you're surrounded by a perfect circus of clowns. And worthlessness abounds because purpose isn't found among cheap talk and overpriced drinks. And, and men who think that money is the answer but lack the capital to pay you attention, pay you a compliment, or even wait for you to ask a question. It's typical aggression, pressing for connecting with a temple that they lack the capacity to understand, like a pre-programmed barbarian at the gate that can't wait for the opportunity to rush your altar and obtain the holiest of holies. At first he had you with his swagger, but every second that he talked, he slowly it up. And I don't know if I believe in fate or soulmates, but I definitely believe in magnetism. And if he can't match your rhythm, then the oscillations of his pendulum should probably swing someplace else on this earth. Maybe, maybe he should start out at a storefront church. He is beneath your cathedral. He needs to learn to perfect the quality of his service, especially if he can't understand that you should be worshiped. Like, like an icon like a monolithic pylon surrounded by ionic columns and marble floors because you deserve more than some jerk sitting next to you at the bar talking about he misplaced his number, can he borrow yours? Or, or sitting there flashing money, asking what would happen if he stuffed your pocket with 20s, trying to entice you with the resource of which you had plenty, and if you had any interest, it was diminished by the shallowness of his verses. What type of maniac doesn't understand that you should be worshipped? But, but instead, he's staring at your skirt with lust. Classless men turn women into mind readers. And still some women believe that they could change him, could fix him, train him to get on his knees and meditate on them like a religion, give him the opportunity to fill their chapel with hymns and a chorus, hoping that he arrives to the occasion 14 times like Horace's father. But why bother to try to change a brute into a priest if his level of exegesis will never be venerable, will never be memorable? He lacks the level of levity necessary to levitate your bacilla above the surface and until you begin to perceive men's energy, you'll never see the degree of spirituality with which you could be. 